Good evening, everyone. This is Tessa Spade on your Tuesday. Sorry, there's no Terra today. Chest still isn't quite up to snuff right now, so we apologize. But it is Tuesday, May 28th, 2024, day 149. I'm out, Craig. Which is, which also means this is the last day with that teal color you see, you know, down here. What last day with the teal color, then we gotta move on to the next color for day 150. Because today's 149. We've made it. Which means tomorrow will mark 150 days of being completely sober. We're, 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 uh, we're feeling all right. Well, I we feel brave that we've been sober this long. We're just not thrilled with how this month we spent just off and on just sick. And I'm glad that the sinus bit, like I said, uh, it went away quickly, so not so much in the sinus anymore. We're a little bit there, but it's moving into our chest. And the chest for us is far, far worse or than the others when it comes to experience. We're highly, sus we, we're, we're highly susceptible to getting pneumonia. But uh, don't expect that to happen this time. Uh, just keeping an eye on it and keeping all of them to the best we can. Oh, just keeping it out of our chest as much as possible. Well, I thought we, while at the congestion, we are, we are out of musets. So we were, we were lucky enough that Tara's father-in-law was able to bring over some, um, Alka-Seltzer stuff. We really like Alka-Seltzer. They have that really nice stuff that's like comparable to Theraflu with that, where it's like, you make it like a hot tea. That stuff works really, really well. It's a lot better than their fizzy gold medicines. It works a lot better. So if you're ever feeling really bad, get that stuff, because uh, that's a of soothing. Uh, but again, sorry, sorry, it's just me again today. So that's that's two instances we owe you. Oh, a dual video. That's two instances we owe you. Because it's just been so... How should I... How should I... Uh, gotta recalibrate. We, we've been experiencing a ton, like, we were gonna try, we, we were gonna try to do a dual video together today, but we're having a whole bunch of problems, not really with hardware, we're having software problems where things don't want to sync properly. It took me an hour just to get VR working properly, because anytime we would start VR chat, it would desync the controllers. To where they're like, oh, the bindings for the for VR chat no longer exist. So as soon as I start VR chat, I can't click on anything. So I had to restart all of Steam and get everything working again. It took an hour. Yeah, sorry about that. So it's just me today. Hopefully we can get it fixed. The blues anytime I turn around, I start crouching for some reason. It, it lights the up. Oh, it lights the up remembering where I put my position for some reason. I'm not a whole lot I can do, but it's already trying again. It's trying to make me crouch. Oh, there I go. Wait, but I do not have an explanation for why it does that. Like, I, I, I try to get it to be a little more obedient. Maybe it's because I'm too close to the wall. But I usually put my camera right over there just so I can lean on the... Lean on the mattress I put on the on the wall whenever needed because it, it helps with effect of some things but I guess it's just too close to the wall so I get the uh the sensor can't rock all of me. Um you best if we had more space to do all of this stuff but you make do right uh Tara and I are in the process of negotiating our new budget because that's coming up um we're looking at the possibility of just not doing PSO2 for the month of June because we need to do more with Buttercup, so... Um... Really, we're, we're trying to get a hold of... We're, we're trying to... Budget our finances to get a, uh... A, uh, new camera. for outside. And I'm not talking a phone camera, because... Phones only do so much. I mean, I, we like the camera that's on our phone. But... It got damaged during a thunderstorm recording. Where, well, I, I think Tara already mentioned that the adhesive undid itself from the phone overheating, just doing a recording, which means that model phone 
no good. Instead of that, or they do it intentionally, of course, you get a new phone. I mean, it's an N4103, and you expect it to last longer, being that you buy a higher-end phone. And planned obsolescence, though. So, and... I just threw a banana down. There it goes. Uh-oh. Apparently, they don't have gravity. But, yeah, as I was saying, they, 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 she subunged it itself on the back plate and let water get in during a thunderstorm recording. So, we still have to fix those lenses up, but we need something that can handle recording outdoors. And it's seeming more and more phone companies don't want you doing outdoor stuff. In fact, they want you to baby their devices completely, at which we did a really good job with that. This is the first time we've ever water damaged a phone in using mobile devices in... 20 years. In 20 years of using mobile phones, near 20 years, so in near tw yeah, in 20 years of using mobile phones, this is the first time we've ever water damaged a phone. We're, we're, we're very careful with our devices. Yet, using it the way it was intended to be used, it, damn it, it got damaged. And insurance isn't gonna cut. Insurance won't cover water damage, even if it's something from a flaw like the adhesive undoing itself. The, the, the backplate separated itself from the phone overheating from normal use. Now, oh, what can you do? So we're, 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 tr I'm true. Kara and I are trying to budget in a new Terra to use outside. We're looking, we're looking at, uh, I can't give a guarantee it's going to happen. We're soaping at 10, but Buttercup and Buttercup wants to do some video projects. IRL. Out, you know, outside doing stuff in nature, just having fun. So we're looking, we're not doing a GoPro. We will not do a GoPro because there's a better camera out there for such things. So we're going to look at a camera, but it still means having to save up four or five hundred dollars for a camera. Ain't it great? <sighs> Plus, our food budget is looking so bad right now. Uh, we only have a little bit left, but we, we, I think, I think we have it to last until Friday. I know it's only Tuesday right now, but it, it's, it's a nail biter right now. I can say that much. It is definitely a nail biter, but uh, it's it's looking like we'll make it. We'll make it. But for the month of June, we are not we are not having our budget go to medicine again. That was this month has been terrible in terms of everyone being sick and spending so so much money on medicine. Too much, way too much. Three hundred plus. On medicine, it, it, you shouldn't have to do that. That's evidently that's too much. But I can't keep this one too long. There's, um, so yeah, that means for the month of June, I th I think we're just gonna not do any premium PSO two. We're just gonna finish up what we've already paid for and just, you know, move to doing other projects. Lilia still needs her VR tap model purchase, so we still need to purchase the one she wants. She's changed her mind on which one she wants, which is okay because it has better features and it looks like it, it'll be easier to work with. So, the one that she wants will get on Gumroad probably on probably on Friday is when she'll get her new avatar. Well, I purchase it twice because it it's a really nice one. It is it is quite nice. Fine, but how the hell? Definitely feeling that in the chest. My chest is a bit, it's a bit weak right now. Uh, and my, the, the computer, oh, right. We also need to budget in a new, um, oh, wait, man. We were able to figure out where the set, where the noise was coming from on the computer. It looks like it's the center front rolling fan, which is going to be a real pain to get out because the, these ones are already a pain. I hopefully we'll have to remove the motherboard just to get to the cooling fans, but if I can get that one replaced, that'd be great. So we need to do that. This shouldn't be too much. It's just the one, but you know, they typically come in sets of three. So we'll see how that goes. Ah, there's just way too much we have to do. And really, it's just a matter of getting to the point of being able to do what we need to do.
we, we still need to get to that point. Because right now, it's just get through the week. This week, it still has the rest of today, which is two booth day. All of Wednesday and all of Thursday to get through. And we're, we're going to have so many eggs. I, I We bought more eggs and bread to really get through it. But egg fried rice is delicious. Although, the kids today, they don't have to worry about having egg fried rice. They get to have pizza rolls because the pizza rolls were cheaper than pizza. And with how they've been behaving with their eating habits, the pizza rolls were a better idea anyway. Much better idea. But I, 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 will, I will give it to the designer of this avatar. I do appreciate that squeezing one trigger when, you know, doing a close fist, squeezing one trigger will wink open. And then the other one was squeezing the other trigger. I do really like that. So I'll be keeping to this one. Although I do still really want that other avatar that I was using for what, like two months? I really like that avatar. I mean, this one's, this one's great. But I would like to have the other one. I have no idea how much he's worth for, or even if he wouldn't let me negotiate, but it's worth acting. It's just getting a hold of them is going to be the belt. And I'm big of Dalula. Oh, right. I'll, tur I'll turn this camera off real quick. And, um, get a good look here. So the world I went to today is just Urban Refuge. It was listed, I think it was under... Branding. But just in case, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add it to favorites. I'm not gonna make it my view. I'm not gonna make it my home just yet. And like many of them, they do have the, uh... It, it does have YouTube viewer... Lots of mirrors. Lots of... Oh, I thought it was one of those stress toys. Lily's gonna love this. Look, it's an axolotl. It's an axolotl. Lily really likes axolotls. I can you oh can you blame her them? Well, I wouldn't say can you blame her. Axolotls are adorable. So there's an axolotl plush. All the plushes just kind of float away. There's this um. Tara is gonna like this one. Hey Tara, how's this one? Does this one look nice? <laughs> and but it blown away too. There it goes. Uh let's see. Apparently there's also this down here. Uh you have to sign up on their Patreon to get the extra features. I don't know what those extra features hello. Another fox. But um yeah, the, you, I, I, I'd have to sign up on their Patreon forever, for however much to uh, figure out what's out there. And we can, I, it's worth checking out, so I might have to ask the creator. Who was the creator of this again? Duh. So Urban Refuge by Zelfine. So maybe I'll contact Zelfine and figure out what the features are for this world. And maybe I'll go check that out sometime, because this place does look really nice. It's small, but you know what? Small is sometimes, some, especially in this case, small is great. I especially love this patio. I love this patio. You can t you can turn the colliders off, but uh Oh yes, I, I do I do oh, light light pick here. It's very tempting to make it the whole world, but people do like that flat too. So people like visiting with me on the flat. But uh, this one this one has a better green, so I might make this the whole world. So in fact what I'll do. Do we like this world? Which has all these amenities, including this bigger, bigger TV, or... Or do we like the old, uh, the, the... The whole world I'm currently using being Cozy Calm. So... Go ahead and leave, go ahead and leave your opinions in the comments below. Do you want this new, uh, um... Urban refuge as our as our home world, or or should we stick with Cozy Calm for our home world? This is Cozy Calm by Camille. We we've been here plenty of times. It also has their own outdoors right here, which I also very much like. It's got its own backyard, and it has another little um nook 
of a couch, a couch nook area over here. Oh, no, that's right. That's gonna get me involved. Yeah, pause that. The music, the music, when it, the music here starts automatically, and if I don't pause and turn it off, it, it, it does get me in trouble, so there is that. But this place has, this place has the upstairs, too. So that's why I'm asking, did we go with the new urban refuge, or did we stick with Cozy Calm? Go ahead and leave your opinions in the comments down below, hit the like button, share with your friends, and of course hit that subscribe button. <laughs> uh, yeah, someone told me I should be doing that more often. I'm not very good at it, but I'll start trying. I, I, I can try, right? But yeah, go ahead and go ahead and let us know uh, which world you'd like us to use as a whole world. And um, from here on, I think we should start supporting the creator. We do need to do more of supporting the creators of these worlds because worlds are just as much work than making it a than making avatars. So I think world designers need more love, too. Anyway... Come here, y'all. Yes, I said y'all. This is Tessa Spade on your Tuesday. I hope everyone has enjoyed their, their May 28, 2024, day 149. I will see everyone tomorrow on hump day. Take care, everyone. I have to go.